everybody, it's Bunny, and it's the first time you've seen me in makeup in like over a week. But I finally was feeling a little bit less of the wintertime depression today, so I got full glitz. Today's video is going to be uh, the Beauty Box 5, and dare I say I'm slightly concerned that this is a repeat of December's box because today is only the 10th of January, and I've had this for a couple of days, and that is super early in the month for me to be getting any subscription boxes. They normally come at the end of the month or sometimes occasionally in the next month, like I'll get January's and February. You know what I mean? You do, if you've been here long enough. So. If this is a repeat box, then you probably won't even be seeing this. All right. The box has been opened. Well, at least I just got the tape undone. It's the small victories. Sippy, sippy. All right, let's get started. What pay up? Please say January. January? Oh, January. We are good to go. Oh, look at this. This is like a fancy, well, I don't know, not that fancy if you stare at it for too long, but I like these balloons. That's a nice motif. That awkward moment. I don't know what that means, but that attracted my attention as well. Oh look, we have more awkward moments. What might this be right on top of the box? Uh, it says that awkward moment. That's nice. Oh, it's like a sticker. All right then. Oh look, it's a mirror. Wow. Look, you can see myself Filming myself, Inception, okay. Next thing I'm seeing in the box is a lip balm. And I think it was in last month's Beauty Box 5, I got a lip balm and I have been obsessed with that one. So maybe I will enjoy this one as well. This is Epic Blend, I've never heard of that brand. And it's called, well the flavor is Hemp Coconut, which is kind of strange. Since I have lipstick on today, I won't be sampling it, but I sure will take a smell. Ooh. This smells really beachy. This is very summer, tropical smelling. I like it. Moving right along. This is a, a tiny little bottle of nail polish and it looks kind of a, a pinky clear color. So I'm assuming it is a clear coat. To, you know what? I will just find out. The brand is Nubar, which I have received this in Beauty Box 5 before, but I've never seen it in the public. I really don't know what this is. I can't tell if it's a clear coat or if it's a base coat. I don't know. I wish I wouldn't have thrown the little card like off to Mars. I, do, I don't even see it. That's how far I threw it. Where are you? Mm. That awkward moment. Oh my God, this is an awkward moment right now. Where is the card? This room, oh, here it is. All the way over here. Man, I should try out for like pro baseball. Look at how far I can throw, or maybe like football. Not at all, no, shouldn't do that, all right. Oh, this is not what I received. I don't know, this is what the new bar product shows on the card. It's got like a little stopper, and that's supposed to be cuticle oil. It's the same color, it's the same brand, but I'm assuming it's not the same product because it doesn't have the same applicator, right? Logical conclusion, all right. The next thing that I see in the box, I am actually very excited about. I am always pretty curious about like glove things that you can use for like brush cleaning or wiping your dirty body to get yourself clean. And these are bath and shower exfoliating gloves. I've never heard of the brand Swissco. That's creepy. My neighbors are being strange and creepy. <laughs> All right, but it's always nice, I think, like in wintertime, when your skin is sloughing off like a snake, dead skin everywhere, it's nice to exfoliate, but a lot of exfoliation products are way too harsh for my skin. I have skin made of paper, I swear. I have the most sensitive skin in the world. Like if I spill some ketchup on myself, I will break into a rash. It's very absurd. I'm allergic to everything, everything bothers me. But these feel like just the tiniest bit exfoliant. So like it would help, but not be too harsh. You know what I mean? Plus it's one of my favorite colors, which is lavender. Nice. Next is an H2O product. And it drives me crazy when they send these products in this box because everyone pretty much knows or has figured out that H2O is the brand that hotels 
use, like it's like a hotel brand, like a hotel sample, like something you would snag on the way out at the end of your vacation. But this does sound kind of intriguing. It's called Sea Lotus Body Wash and just Sea Lotus. That name appeals to me. I'm all, smell it. This smells really nice and fresh, but also kind of like a hotel room. I don't know. I might use this just because it's so small and I kind of do like the smell. I don't know. I can't really like complain too too. I just complained, but I retract the complaint because it's fascinating. Anyway, last thing in the box is also super plain Jane. It is the Jurgens Daily Moisturizer. Once again, this is an item that you would pick up like in the Walmart travel section. It's certainly nothing expensive, different, new, or that impressive. It's nice. I've definitely bought this before. I used to buy like the big bottles of this Jurgens Moisturizer. It's pretty cheap. It's not a bad product, but but it's not that fun. Do you know what I mean? I'm not that crazy overall about this. Oh, that is cuticle oil. Wow. I'm disturbed and impressed. Like I touched my own hand and I didn't expect it to be moist. That was like an alarming surprise. <gasps> so this is cuticle oil. So that kind of changes my opinion. Now I'm kind of more impressed with this than I was before when I thought it was just a clear average top coat. Do you like? I like this. I like this. And I like this. I'm on the fence about this. I kind of like it. Ooh, look, the bubble is traveling. Do you see the bubble? Can you see the bubble? The bubble. The bubble. Wow. Wow. It's like a lava lamp. And the last thing that we are left with in this box is the greatest by far. We don't have that many of them. Look at this. This is like, this is all the worms that we have in January. They must feel sad too. They didn't really want to come to party. Hello, worms. Worms. Not that many worms, just a few worms, worms. All right, that is it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you guys are doing well. I hope y'all are recovering from the winter sad feelings like I'm slowly recovering. And I hope you have a great weekend. If you're not already, please take a minute and hit that button down below. Subscribe, become a member of the Swamp Family and give an alligator its wings. Also, if you want, you can like me on Facebook, facebook.com slash graveyard girl, or you can follow me on Twitter, Tumblr, or Instagram at graveyard girl, same way it's spelled here. I will see you guys tomorrow. Love y'all. Bye.